Hear me out, hear me out. Hear me out, firstly. No, you've been talking for a setting, long time. setting, setting, setting here, setting the scene. If I need 10 minutes to make my point, okay. and you need 20 minutes to make your point, you should take first. 20 minutes. The background of the first. Do you understand? The Jews, the Jews are the, are you listening? What did I just say? No, what, what did I just say? Hang on. Excuse me. What did I just say? No, what did I just say? I said, if I take, if I take three minutes to make my point, no, I'm setting the principle. If I take three minutes, Listen, if I take three minutes to make a point and you need ten minutes to make a point, it's only fair to give you ten minutes, not three. I don't believe in equality, I believe in equity. Right? Do you agree with that? Is that fair? I don't believe in equity, I believe in equality. Oh, so you believe, for example, and No 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 I, I wanna understand your 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 take. No no I wanna understand because I believe Go then, go, go. I'm here, you go. No, we agree that there is no problem. Don't lie. Don't lie. The Quran doesn't say that. So what does it say? Don't lie in front of the people. Who found it setting? Yeah, he found it. He went somewhere to see when it. Oh, so because he went so far to the west, he saw when the sun when the sun set, and there were people nearby, and they had dark skin. Then he went the other direction. He saw when the sun rose. It, he didn't. If it, when, when, when if does he, the sun, where does the sun rose? If he, if he, if he goes that direction, you don't need to go somewhere to see where the sun sets. So the, the Quran is saying that he went somewhere and he found the sun setting and he found That's, the people nearby and he was said, do something to these people or, or leave them alone. That's, what that did you understand verse. by the word? Hatta, when he reached the point of sunset. What do you understand by that? You don't need to go somewhere to see where the sun sets. No, no, what do you understand by the term until he reached the place when the sun is setting? He found it setting, yeah. He, he had to go somewhere to see where the sun sets. Wrong. You don't have to go anywhere to Wrong. see Wrong, let me setting. correct you. You can stand You can stand in one direction unless you believe that the sun is setting on earth. Let me correct you then. Let me correct you what you don't read. When you read the Quran superficially, that's the level of understanding you get. Yeah, I've read the, the Quran. Story, mate. The Quran, I'm not your mate. I'm not your mate. The okay. Quran is describing Dulkarnain with a mission and he's traveling. As he's traveling, a point came, the point when the sun was setting. It's not that he was waiting for the sun to set. He reached that point destination when the sun happens to be setting at that time. It's not that he's just, oh, when is the sun going to set? Do you understand this? When I'm traveling and I reach a point like Marvel Large and the sun is setting, it's not that I'm waiting for the sun to set. It just happens to be that while I am at Marble Arch, I reached that point when the time was there for the sun to set. So this is what he's describing. He found it setting in this murky pool of water. It doesn't mean God is saying the sun sets in a murky pool of water. God is simply describing his perception, his journey, what he saw, what his vision is, perception. And you somehow read with some twisted logic that yes, you know what, according to Islam, according to God, the sun sets in a murky pool of water. You need to really be more, more really genuine and sincere to understand that the Quran is a book that invites you to worship Allah alone. And what do you do instead? You worship Jesus Christ. So what did the Hadith say though? You worship Jesus Christ. No, so what did the Hadith say? What did the Hadith yeah, say? Let's, I want to hear your response. So if you find something, what do you have to do before you find it? I don't understand your question. You look for something. No, I'm not looking for anything. You look for something and no. then you find it. No. So it says, he didn't just look for something. So he followed away until when he reached the setting of the sun, he found it. Yeah, he, he didn't have to go he anywhere. Was, he was looking for something yeah. and then he found it. The, the word Arabic is wajada. Do you know what it means? Dark water. What does word wajada mean? Oh. I find you insincere. Did I seek you to be insincere? You came to her, she never came no, to no. you. When I say I find you insincere, oh, okay. am I seeking you all to be insincere? What does the word me finding you insincere mean? The word found and finding. You I'm going to now teach you a little bit of English, question? which you seem to be misunderstanding from reading the English text rather than the Arabic. I told you, wajada indaha. He found wajada Arabic word. Doesn't mean like he was seeking for it. It's just that at that point, this is what he found. 
So when I find you insincere, what does it mean even in English? You can tell by the context that it means this is the way that person seems to you. And from this context... When I find clear, you insincere... From this context, it's very clear that he was on the way. He said he was following the way, he was going somewhere, and then he reached the setting of the sun, and he found it. So he was looking for the sunset? You know it's a mistake. Hang on. on. No, he oh, no, it's not. You can laugh about it, it's not. So the laughing is not going to just help you. No, he wasn't. You need to have a solid argument, not laugh. He went right. so far yeah. in one direction. Laughing, laugh is not an argument he went so far to prove anything. Direction. So, you don't need to go did he go to find where the sunset and sunrise is? No, he went so far in one direction. He saw I'm where asking the her. Sunset then he went so far in the other Respect direction. Respect women? He saw well, she, Do you believe in equality? Well, I, I was talking with her and you came to us. But, but you're you the one responding. So you do, you, do you find... Why do you have to go somewhere to see the sun setting? He you didn't go, go. there's a sunset. No, That's he, what I'm saying. He, he went, you, your he so level of comprehension needs he a little bit more push so because the, he didn't go there to find where the sun is setting. Look, let's talk about the Quran. No, you, you don't understand the hadith. So, you don't understand the hadith. The Quran, I'm dealing with the Quran. It's translated into English. No, I'm, I'm telling you the Quran. So, I'm asking you. Hello? When, when I find you insincere. Okay. I came here, I came here 20 minutes ago, yeah. and I have and found you, you insincere. Over, you took Wait. over my conversation. Hello, I'm talking now. You took over my I came here 20 minutes ago, and, and I found her insincere. We what does it mean? We didn't invite you. We didn't invite you. Okay, <laughs> what does it mean I found you insincere? I was talking to you. Oh, 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 sorry. Can, can you now respond? Yeah. Can you now respond? And, 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 and make the point. Can you now respond to my point? No, but the thing is, I don't need to go anywhere to find you insincere. Can I don't need to go anywhere. To we don't need to go anywhere. 20 minutes ago I came and I found you insincere. Yeah, so what is your understanding of my statement, I found thing. you it's insincere? That's not the same thing, because we don't have to go somewhere. I found you insincere. <laughs> no, no, you no, make what a is, point. What do I mean yeah, by yeah, founding go, insincere? Go, go, go. What does it mean? You as being insincere. No, not about you, you my statement. That. I perceive you as being insincere. Look, you can perceive me as being the, the you know, you know, a, a woman at this, like... What point are you making? I identify as a woman at this What point are you trying to make? What point are you trying to make? Yeah, I'm a woman. So what point are you trying to make? Yeah? What no, point are you trying to make? Yeah, I'm a woman. Yeah. And, and I, I find you. And, 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 and you're a man. You're a man. Right? You're a man. Right? I'm a woman. You're a man. Do you see the problem? What point are you trying to make? I'm saying the point. Thank you. The point I'm making is very, very interesting for you to reflect on. You read an English translation despite me giving you the Arabic. And you seem to, seem to still persist in the understanding that. When Dhul Qarnayn well, went, um, stop interfering. <laughs> so when Dhul Qarnayn <laughs> went, and he, and he, as he reached that destination, he found the sun setting. You somehow think in your comprehension that he actually went looking for where the sun is going to set. So I gave you a similar analogy. 20 minutes ago I came and I found you insincere. So my statement that I found you insincere, does it mean to you consistently, using the same hermeneutic principle? I'm not finished. I'm not finished. Hello? I'm not finished. I'll let you speak. I'll let you speak. So if I say I found you insincere, it is not that I came here with the intention of seeking your insincerity. I just happened to find you insincere at the spot in the discussion that I'm having. Likewise, when Dhul Qarnayn was on his journey to the east or the other ways yeah. he reached his traveling remember he's traveling traveling until he came to a land in well, which that's where the sun was setting it doesn't mean he was seeking where, where oh let me found where the sound sun is setting this is your mistaken reading of the text go and speak to no, a no. academic did he see a people non-muslim like people for example by? for they example a, hang on. To a place. let me finish they for example for example, Christian, Christian academic scholars who study the Quran, ask them how do they understand this, this verse rather than Tom, Dick and Harry like yourself so you're making a mockery every week, every, every week. Are you what, telling what me Christian knows better than you? Are you not Tom, Dick and Harry? Oh, are you scholars? Okay, are you scholars? Are you telling me I need to go to a Christian to ask him about a Quran? No, I Christian said not a Christian, a scholar. You misrepresent again. You misrepresent again. Scholars. 
Hip in the bath. Do you know why he's a Christian scholar? Hip in the bath. I, I tried to show you in the bath. No, I asked you for your own support. You can go to your own people, the Christians, and you can go to the Christian scholarship to understand that. You don't have to go to a Muslim scholar. I'm not taking his. Do you understand? You're yes, sir. Abu the messenger of Allah who is riding a donkey while the sun was setting. He asked, do you know where the sun has set? I replied, Allah and his apostle know that. He said, it sets in a spring of warm water. It They're sets not, yeah. in a spring of warm water. It doesn't say it seems like it, or it may be. It says it sets. He's describing to... No, he's describing to... Look, as I said, he's describing to the people and he's explaining to the... It's it's to the people. Abu Dhar. It's it's set. Set. Yes. It's Abu Dar. Yes. Who was with him? Four Who was with him? Yeah. So that's why. No, no. Yes. 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 That's what I'm saying. You cannot. You cannot take this. You cannot take this and apply what the Quran is saying because hadiths are often narrated by oh, people yes. by the meaning. Do you reject the hadith? Did you even hear what I said? Do you reject the hadith? Did you even hear what I said? No, no, Do you reject the hadith? Of course not. But did you even hear what I said? Right, let me tell you what I heard. Because you're not listening. Hadiths, the narrations are often narrated by exact wording or by meaning. Hadith lafzi and hadith ma'anawi. Right? There is two components of the hadith. One is the chain of narrators and one is the text. What you're talking about the chain of the narrators? The chain of the narrators could be all Correct, meaning all reliable narrators. We are talking about the contents. Okay. Is the content narrated by meaning, the by the person who's narrating, or is the content narrated by textual, by text, word for word? So I'm going to ask you now my question. Look, I'm interested in. No, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait. I'm not finished. I'm not finished. I'm, my point is this when we as Muslims in the Christian debate, our first point of discussion should be about God. Not about where the sun sets, well, because according to the Bible, because God. according to the Bible, the sun sets also in the ocean. You're changing the subject. No, I am no, gearing it to the subject that we should be discussing. I, we, 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 I want you to know, is your God worthy of worship? We just gave you a hadith. I've just told you. I've answered. Why I've already Ibn answered. Ibn why is Ibn Abbas I've answered no, already. No, Do you not understand? understand? You just went all over the place. You went to the Bible. You don't understand because you are what? Ibn Agrist. Yeah. Because you are a your little person? Yeah. Or because you are a scholar? That hadith that we gave you before. What did I say? Between Muslims and Christians, yeah. the discussion shouldn't be, oh, does the sun set in a murky water or in your own head? The discussion should be, who is worthy of worship and who is Jesus? You came into our so, I am changing the subject. I am. You came into our discussion. Do you have a comprehension yes, problem? Do you came into our discussion. No, I don't. Did you not get it? Okay, so so how now do I'm you telling you, I am moving away from a bigger you? issue, uh, which is, away. do you worship God who is worthy of worship? Away. I'm not running away. I've already away. explained. I don't need to explain you're myself you're twice. Now, let me ask you this question again. Where is that? Where is do you worship again? Jesus Christ? We've got, we've got, we've got, we've got for the do you worship Jesus Christ? Hello? Okay. I am going to talk about God. Do you worship Jesus Christ? So, before we change no, the subject, we have changed the subject. Do you, <laughs> do you worship Jesus Christ? There isn't. I'm not going to move on unless you first accept oh. that there is an exception Well, I'm going to talk about your, your Jesus Christ is God, right? I'm going to talk about Jesus Christ. Okay, I'm not going to so, move on anywhere. So, do you now believe? you're running away you can't because... From where? From where? <laughs> so when the Quran, hang on, when did, does the Quran say the sun sets in a hill? Ibn Abbas, did you get Does the sun you get set in a hill according to the Quran? You get did you? No, it doesn't. No, I didn't. So, I didn't. so I now I'm going to ask you now, you know, my next question to you. Do you worship Jesus Christ? Shut up. Is he risen? Do you worship the Kaaba? Is the Lord... Do you worship the Kaaba? No. Is the Lord risen? Why do you pray to it? So why do you pray to I don't pray to the Kaaba. Oh, you don't pray to the Kaaba? I don't pray to the Kaaba. So what you pray to Mecca? I don't pray to the Kaaba. So what are you praying to? So what are you praying to? Do you... So what are you praying to? Do you worship Jesus Christ? That's fine. 
I have a question for you. Do you worship your prophet? Do I don't worship my prophet? Do you worship your prophet? Can you tell me your prayers? Do you worship your prophet? Let's get this straight. Let's get to know the God that we are worshiping. Why are you so scared? Why are you so scared to talk about your Lord that you believe is risen? Because I have already explained to you. You are scared to talk about God. I am. I am. I would like to talk to you if you're available. Can you talk about God? About your oneness problem. Okay, now uh, let's talk to him. Yes, awesome. Do you believe? So, okay, uh, let's, set, let's set the scene. I know let's set the scene. Quite, quite often. Let's set talk the scene. About the oneness let's set the scene. Stop okay. it. Stop I'm very rules of engagement. Rules of engagement. Yeah. Okay. So, do you want to be times? No, what are the rules of engagement? By the way, amen. 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 By the way, okay. Are you part of the CTI? Amen. Are you part of Soko? Are you part of Soko? Don't worry about who I'm part of. It's important. Okay. Because I don't give free time to Soko. Mentor. Um, are you part of Soko? I have an issue. Are you part of Soko or Loko? Oneness of Allah. So you make it seem as though no, that Allah is, is one in essence and in person. But it seems oh, let's, as though let's talk from what's within the Quran that Allah's oneness is more so a position and not a matter of fact with his personality or his being. Can you uh, give me so, one meter? Back off. Well, you, back, you, you back off. Now you so, came to it, me. It, yes, I didn't come to you. So, so you back off so, one meter. Can you explain to me what Have you some of engagement. to mean that Allah is one? Do you want it to be timed? Because I think that no, Allah No, take your time is, as much as you want. That's fine. I don't see Allah as yeah. being absolute one, as a monad, as a single entity that has no parts. Uh, I see him as having compartments. Do you think differently? Are you finished? All done. Good. Right. You know what I said? The rules of engagement is take as much as you want as necessary. So he's taking his time. I'll give you an option again. If you're not finished, carry on until you've made your point. Yes, but let's cap it at like three minutes. No. Yes. No. But Mansour, you haven't talked for a long period of time. I give you enough time so, to make your point. Go on, make your point. point. Yeah, but you talk for so long sometimes. That's that, your problem, uh, not mine. I feel like I'm going to fall asleep. So can we like... That's your problem. Why point? would you talk to somebody that makes you fall asleep? Well, we'll talk somebody else. that can talk to simply. You know? He came here that's right, pretty boy. To speak to him. Okay, yes, that's fine. So, let's time it. Three minutes? No, no uh, timing. Why you no timing. So, take your time as much as you want. Hmm. Just take it. Will this work? Uh, okay, so, if Mansour talks too long, then we're going to have to cut him. Agreed? No. No. No? No. no. The rest of you guys. Too no. long. Do you want to have Mansour talk for five hours or maybe five yeah, minutes? Yeah, if I, I need to. to as long as however long. Needs. I'm patient. However long. However long to make your point. Will this work? That's the rule of engagement yes, here and now. If you're willing to discuss with me, I'm taking. If no, you want to take your time, five I, hours, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. Mansour, I'm going to have to insist that we time it. Hmm? I'm going to have to insist that we time it. Oh, so there's yeah. no discussion then? No oh, rules oh, of engagement, oh, no. no discussion. No, wait, wait. So why do the rules? He, you have came to, to me. Be what you want? He came to you me. Came begging. Well, Mansour, begging. You came to the lady, and, and you, you, came were, to you were fine interrupting her. Lady, so I am simply trying. To